Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's finally time to open my Stitch Fix box and I've had this for a couple weeks <laughs> and I'm just now getting around to unboxing it, but I'm super excited. I always get so excited when I get my Stitch Fix because it's like Christmas. Those of you that don't know, or maybe you're new, welcome. Stitch Fix is a monthly subscription. You pay $20. You get clothes and shoes and purses and jewelry and you keep what you like and you send back what you don't like. <coughs> oh my God. I'm dying, apparently. Hopefully this month is better than last month's box. The first thing I got is this, whatever this is. Ooh, it's a sweater. Not only is it really soft, I do like this. I need more like plain colored clothes because everything I have has like a design on it. And so it's hard to wear like cute jackets that have designs and then a shirt that has a design. I feel like it's a little much. The sleeves are kind of like big and then they get smaller. So hopefully that doesn't make me look like I have a fat arm or maybe it will cover up my fat arm. Who knows? This is from Colette, the Sadie Dolman Brushed Rib Knit Top, and it is $40. Next, we have this. Whatever that seems. What is this? I like to think that I'm a person that wears kimonos, but I already have one and I literally never wear it. The sleeves has this like lace thing on it, and I was. I'm not sure how I feel about like the half sleeve though. It feels a little weird. And then at the bottom, it also has this lace material. I don't think I like it, honestly. The fact that I can't decide if I like it means I need to send it back. This is from Mason and Bell, Laura Crochet Trim Kimono, and it's $42. Uh, next is the flat top with this, these little stringy things right here in the front. It looks like it is a half sleeve black top. It is very soft. I was just complaining about how I don't have more plain colored items in my uh, closet, but all the plain colored clothing, <laughs> clothing, all the plain colored clothing I do have is black. So I don't need another black shirt because black makes you look skinnier. Duh. This is from Emory Park, the Dulce three fourth sleeve cross front shirt, and it's $38. Three fourth sleeve? I, I have never heard of that. <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing. Next. This feels like it's gonna be a sweater. This seems cozy. It does have this detail here, right here on the sleeve that I do like. It gives it a little like, you know? I do have a hoodie that's similar to this, but it's blue and I literally wear it all the time. So if this fits, I might probably keep it. This is from Mix by 41 Hawthorne, the Callion Brush Knit Hoodie, and it is $38. Finally, the last thing I got, are these, what is this? Are these sweatpants? No, they didn't. They sent me jogger pants. I'm not complaining. I'm okay with getting sweatpants and like cozy clothes. <laughs> this is what pisses me off about myself. I have all of these cute clothes and like these cute tops, but I literally don't ever wear them. I always wear my sweatpants and my hoodies and my cozy clothes. So like realistically, I'm thinking like, do I need these jogger sweatpants? But I would wear them because that's all I wear. This is from Andrew Mark Performance, the Rosalie Knit Joggers, and they're $50. What? Of course, the thing I'm most excited about is the most expensive. So after trying everything on, I am going to be sending the majority of these things back. I liked this sweatshirt. If I didn't have one already that was similar to it, I would be keeping it because I think it's cute and cozy to wear around the house or when I go to the grocery store or whatever. But since I already have one like it, I think it'd be pointless to have two. So I am going to send this back. The kimono, after trying it on, I'm just not really a big fan of it. So I'm going to send this back to you. Out of all of it, I think the black shirt was my favorite, <laughs> but I already have like 300 million bazillion black shirts, so I don't need to keep it. So I'm sending it back. I liked the joggers. They were very comfy. They were very cozy, but for $50, I think that's a little bit ridiculous to keep uh, for some sweatpants that I would just wear around the house. So I'm going to send these back too. This sweater I did like. It was a little too fitted around my abdominal area. So I think that's why I wasn't crazy, crazy about it. But if it was a little bit more loose fitting and more comfy and not so like trying to show off my figure that I don't got, then I would have kept it. But because of that 
I'm gonna send this back to you. Even though I'm sending everything back, I'm not disappointed in this box. I really enjoyed trying all of these things on and I was really excited to try all these things on. Definitely better than last month's box. Let me know what your favorite things were from this box. What do you think I should have kept? Is $50 for joggers a little bit ridiculous? I think it's a little bit ridiculous. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you're having an amazing day or amazing night wherever you are. My Birch family, remember to stay weird and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.